Welcome to the Slopecast Interlibrary Loans. How do I order books from other libraries? Interlibrary Loans allow you to order items such as books or articles as copies. If they are neither available at the Slope Dresden nor at any other publicly accessible library in Dresden. If you are unsuccessful in searching the SLUB catalog, this link will take you directly to the Interlibrary Loan portal. Alternatively, you can also access the portal for Interlibrary Loans via our homepage. Click on the tab Visit, continue with Ordering and Borrowing, and select Delivery Services Interlibrary Loan. Here you will find all the important information on interlibrary loans, contact details of interlibrary loan staff members, as well as the link to the research portal from which orders will be submitted. The link will take you to the home page of the research portal. This is what it looks like. At this point, you have to select the library that you want the requested items to be delivered to. That is, in our case, the Slup Dresden. If this is not the case, you can select the Slup Dresden via Change Library. Please note that even if you are already logged in on the Slup website, you will have to log in again at the research portal using your Slup access data. Before you start your search, you should know that the research portal is a catalog which lists all available holdings. It is not possible to order every item that is displayed here via interlibrary loan. Whether an item is available for interlibrary loan or not is always at the discretion of the library providing the item. Holdings from libraries that do not participate in the interlibrary loan system are also indicated here. Now you can start your search. First, you should always search for the title of the requested item in the research portal. If to hand, it is best to search for books using the ISBN. In so doing, you limit the number of search results for the title you are looking for. If the search does not provide any relevant results, you can fill in the so-called free in the library loan form. However, this happens rather rarely. Please use the free interlibrary loan form only after having searched the portal without any result. Here is how you would ideally submit an order. In this example, we use the ISBN as search term. Of course, you can also enter the author and or the title or title keywords. In the list of search results, you will see different types of media which are marked with corresponding symbols. Here we will focus on the symbol for monographs, that is, books. We will discuss the other symbols in detail later on. The first search result in the list is the one you are looking for and you select it by clicking on it. By clicking on the tab Libraries, you can already get a general overview of the availability of the title. Please treat the displayed information with caution, because the availability status of interlibrary loans is not always accurate at this point of the ordering process. Going back to the tab in the library loan, you can submit the interlibrary loan request. At this point, at the latest, you must log in to the research portal. After successfully completing the login, the button Order via Interlibrary Loan appears. By clicking on it, the actual order form appears. The data for the title will be automatically transferred to the form. The default order form for books indicates loan, but you can also switch to order a copy, if you only want to order a few pages of the title as a copy, for example. Now you have to select the branch library where you want to pick up the item when delivered. Then. Do not forget to tick the declaration for private use and, eventually, you can finalize your order. Here are some additional tips for you. If you have several relevant search results for the title you are looking for, then it is best to select, if possible, the one that is available in the SWB network. The reason for doing so 
is that the SWB network includes the holdings of the SLUB Dresden and other libraries in Dresden. Hence, you can avoid unnecessary in the library loan orders that will have to be cancelled later on. As already mentioned, different types of media are marked with corresponding symbols. You already know the symbol for print editions of monographs. You should pay attention to this symbol, especially when ordering books. Ebooks are not available for interlibrary loan. If you want to order an ebook via interlibrary loan, you have to look for a respective print edition of the ebook that you need. We are going to explain the symbols for print edition journals, electronic journals, and articles in another slipcast. And last but not least, don't be confused by the so called unknown format. It simply signifies different types of media. This could be an off print of a journal or an electronic resource, for example. That is all for now. Thank you for your interest and for watching the tutorial. We hope that this slipcast helps you and we look forward to your feedback. If you feel like ordering journal articles from other libraries now, but you still lack the know-how, then please have a look at our second part on interlibrary loans.